Hello, here's as always Anton Pavlinov and the Food Hacker. One of the first videos on this channel was about learning to juggle the ball. And since then, I've got many complaints of not being able to master this skill. And I think it's time to finally clarify this issue. Moreover, today we have such a perfect guest. Welcome, Sasha. What is up? Remember? The same guy who was mastering tricks at the age of four. And you really liked him. And today we're gonna check out what he has been able to reach since then. And hello, Alex. How are you? I'm good. What have you been doing in quarantine? Juggling. Tell me, what was your juggling record seven months ago when the quarantine was imposed? 20? Yeah. Using both feet, of course. Your grandpa told me that you've been practicing all this time, and your juggling record exceeded 100 times. Is that true? Yes. Really? Yes. And you can prove that, can you? Sasha, I believe you, but I'm still a bit nervous. Hope you can do this. Ready? Great, let's go! But firstly, let's take a look at a couple of exercises that will help to learn this technique. Exercise 1. Throw the ball from your hands, kick it one time back into your hands. This helps us to find the place of our foot which allows us to strike the ball strictly upwards. In my case, it's the beginning of laces. Also, make sure your foot is tensed to make the ball bounce off. Our goal is to do 20 reps with each foot without losing the ball. Exercise number 2. Juggling with letting the ball touch the ground. It teaches us to control not only your feet, but the whole body. Try to stand in one place, not running around. After each touch, let the ball hit the ground, then kick it again with another foot. The third exercise – gradual increase. Start with two kicks, switching legs. Our goal is to do that 15 times without losing the ball. If it's accomplished, add one more touch. Now do 15 sets of three touches, then 15 sets of four, and so on. Okay, guys, the decisive moment. Sasha, can you juggle over 100 times from the first attempt? Yes. You're sure? Yes. Okay, then. Good luck. The main goal was achieved from the first attempt. Then I asked Alex not to stop and keep juggling, and I'll just speed it up. That is awesome! 276 times! Hey, hey, what's wrong? Are you upset? This is unbelievable! More than 100 times from the first attempt! I'm pleased with the result. Good job! A high five! Hey, it hurts! Okay, you're just kidding. Let's have a rest. Now I'm going to answer the most common questions about juggling. I think it's better to do be able to do both. Juggling with toes allows you to control the ball extremely precisely, which is useful in football freestyle. From the other hand, juggling with laces is more suitable in soccer. 
No, it shouldn't, but it's not a problem if it spins a bit. All these things don't matter at all. You can get used to everything. I invited Alex today to answer these kind of questions, to explain that it's more likely the problem isn't your approach. Because if you face such problems, maybe you practice not properly enough or give up too soon. There are no other options. Because, in case of Sasha, I didn't reveal any secrets to him. We was just doing the same exercises I showed you today. He just worked harder. All you need is to try, 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 and one more time try. Everything's pretty simple. Here's no other secrets. Don't thank me. Well, Alex, are you pleased with the result? Yes. Are you good? Yes. Okay, I think so too. And thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed this episode. Hope it was useful. Don't forget to support me by pressing the like button. And I'm asking Sasha to set the number of likes that we should collect under this video. Infinity. Oh, infinity. That's a bit more than under the previous episode. Infinity of likes, friends. Don't forget to let me know in the comments your juggling record. I'll read all of them. And, of course, so that not to miss the most awesome videos about football tricks, what we gotta do? Subscribe. Exactly. And ring the bell. See you soon.